I will say this, and this is the last, I won't give any more of this. He, Tyler, character is dead. Because I, that is something that I needed to project to move Erica into the next phase. She needs to find out about that. Um, you know, as far as the audience disliking him, um, you know, I, I feel bad because I feel partially responsible that I didn't write an interesting number of him. Um, you know, again, I started after episode four, so some of that groundwork was laid down, but I, I like Logan a lot, and I think Logan's actually really talented as an actor, and unfortunately, this one role for him just seemed to great fans the wrong way, and, um, you know, so, he, you know, but no, he, he, uh, he is definitely, Tyler's character is 100% dead. Yeah, that's, that's really my readers will appreciate that. What's that? My readers, I, my readers will appreciate that. Yeah, yeah. And it does make for an amazing story, Erica, yeah. going forward. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I mean, that's like, you know, that's sort of obviously like why, you know, I, I planned that out from the very beginning. In the first episode, there was the flash, you know, the dream sequence where Tyler dies, and I wanted that to be, that was supposed to be a version of foreshadowing. Um, so I always knew that he was going to die at the end of the season because I wanted to... Um, I wanted that her nightmares were true.